So I'm chilling out on my veranda and the sun is out kind of, but it's behind some clouds. And um, right now it actually came through a little bit, but just prior to this, it was actually behind the clouds, not really a sunny day, mostly overcast. But that doesn't mean it's not worth sitting out in the sun, sitting outside a little bit. Uh, it probably won't be any possibility of me producing vitamin D from this sun exposure because it's not very strong and uh, there's a lot of cloud in front of it. So I'm not really sitting here for the vitamin D. Well, you know, the main reason I'm sitting here is just because it's enjoyable to be outside. Just enjoying a little, you know, sitting in outside. It's just, <laughs> that's the reason I'm sitting here, really. But as an added bonus, uh, I'm, uh, I wanted to encourage you to sit out and sort of get sunlight on your body, especially in your face and into your eyes, even though it's overcast, because it stimulates the production of serotonin, which further stimulates the production of melatonin. Well, it's actually the precursor. Serotonin is the precursor to melatonin, the sleep hormone. So sitting a little bit in the, getting some sunlight not necessarily direct sun shine, you know if I mean, like now it's actually coming out and it's more of a direct thing. But if it's an overcast day, just get out there and just sort of look up towards the sun and just get a little bit of it in your face. Take your lunch outside if you're working indoors or whatever and make it an emphasis in your life to get s daylight, to get daylight into your eyes so that you are happier, more motivated and ultimately sleep better at night. I know this for myself, if, if there's a period at, during autumn, for example, in Norway, where there's no, no sunshine for like several days, just rainy, just overcast, I have real trouble sleeping. So get that daylight into your eyes. It stimulates uh, some glands in your brain that again uh, produces these hormones. So sun or no sun, get out there and look up towards wherever the sun is at where the sky is a little bit brighter than where the sun isn't at you know what i mean even though it's or overcast we can usually find out and locate where the sun's at just because it's a little bit brighter right there look up towards it maybe close your eyes or keep them open depending on how strong the light is and just you know just take 10 minutes 15 minutes 20 minutes whatever it takes eat your lunch eat your dinner eat your breakfast whatever uh, just bring sunshine into your life it's important remember we got lots of other videos on sunshine so you can check out our sunshine playlist right here and in the meantime hope you're having a good day and i'll see you around